Turn that off. Crystal, turn it off. Turn it off. I'm going to die with my finger on the trigger. Come on, turn that off and stop singing like you're all ghetto fight. Leave my radio alone. She puts her middle finger on the off button. She's a unbelievable sometimes. The first time I started disliking my mom, the first time she put me in the hospital. I started disliking her when I was eight years old. That's it. I have no respect for you. I have nothing for you. I don't, I love you, but I don't love you like if you were my mom. You are my mom, but I don't love you like that. You, you ain't nothing to me. I mean, if something happens to you, I'm gonna cry, but after a while, I'm gonna get over it. I'm, I'm gonna forget you. Just like that. Oh, Crystal, Crystal, Crystal. I'm really upset at Crystal. She knows the rules and she um, has broken my rules. To me, this is the ghetto. There's a little bit worse neighborhoods, but this is Puerto Rican ghetto. Gangs over there, gangs on the other side, gangs going north, west, east, south. We're surrounded. We're right in the middle. We're in the heart of it all. I've had to go out in the streets with my other daughters looking for Crystal. I would not want a police officer to come knocking at my door telling me, we need you to come and identify this body. That's my biggest concern with Crystal. Okay, um, so, they're using the word grievance. Does anybody know what the word grievance means? Because that's a big word. Grievance. When you have a grievance, what does that mean? I don't know, tell us. Put it in your terms for me. Go ahead, tell us. Think it. about it. Skills for handling a grievance. I don't plan to run away. It just happens. I'll be with a male or a female, and it'll be 9 o'clock. Like 9.30, I have to be home by 10. And they'll just be like, just sleep over. And I'll be, okay, that's it. And when I sleep over, I'm, I'm not going back home. So then I don't go back home and I just stay out until I get caught. Crystal, this is your mom. If you get this message, at least text me and let me know you're okay. Bye. If I look at my call log, I've been calling her since 8.45 this morning. She said, I'm just gonna go hang out with my friend and then later I'll be back for report card pickup. No Crystal. Damaris, yeah. come on, we have to go to Crystal school and get her report card. We're not gonna wait for Crystal, doesn't help. And here we are, I'm on a fear. They're gonna look at me like, oh, here comes Crystal's mother. I'm always worried of what do they think of me due to Crystal's behavior? I worry that people feel that what is her mother not doing that this child behaves in this manner? And that's sad because the first thing that people look at is what type of mother does this child have that she can't even control her own daughter? I want you to listen to me. You're being disobedient. Do you want to be in this school? Do you want to come to this school? Mama. I don't think you want to come to this school. Look, you have to see him every morning. <laughs> She'll just roam the hall and go to where she wants to. Oh, okay. So, very defiant, huh? Yeah, she can be very defiant. Nice. She can be very defiant. Um, this is her work, but like I said, she misses my test. So that's probably why her grade was as low as it was in science. And she tells me she was doing so well. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty much. We don't have the greatest report, so. Okay. That's, that's the biggest I could tell you about Crystal, so. Just look at this, you really get to see what goes on in a bus. No, 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 no. Tamara, sit over there while I, when mommy watches this. Look at your sister. But she's not thinking, she's talking with a lot of anger issues. She acts like this all the time. Wow. Wow. And all these kids are all angry. Look at that. This is every single kid there. Their mouth is filthy.
Oh my god, he's screaming. This is terrible. When she gets frustrated with the teacher or mad about something, she will have a tendency to walk out. Crystal is someone who needs some outside activities. So whatever type of outside activities that you can get her engaged in. I took her to the YMCA and she refused to let me sign her up. But it's getting her engaged in some positive activities so she'll stay away from the negative, negative. activity. All right. Yeah. Is she going to transition to a regular school? school and not not right yet. Now. You don't see that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Come on, Damaris. You're misbehaving. You're giving me a hard time. Let's go. Sit back there. Crystal has not attempted at all to text or call me. Where is Crystal? What is she doing? Who is she with? This is where I feel I have no control over my child. And it's not a very good feeling. My name is Agustin Bartolo and I'm 12 years old. I was born with hemophilia and syndrome in Macon. The new name for me, they made up, which I don't care, is Two-Face. I gotta be at the hospital almost every day, and when kids mess with me, I just go like angry. I don't think about my actions. I just go off like a monster. <laughs> So this is the MRI of your brain right here, and you can see the higher areas of the brain right here. All this that you can see here, the white part, that's bone which is overgrown. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Actually the right eye is moved forward. So the number one risk is losing vision during the surgery from that right eye. There could be a damage to the carotid artery. Uh, and as a result, he can have a stroke. He can have massive bleeding during the surgery. If we don't do it, it can just get worse and cause blindness. And he might have to later on have the left side uh, operated on as well. I'm also scared of like my life. Like, um, I might pass away. The risk of you passing away during the surgery is much, much less, okay? It's a, definitely a serious surgery. Think it over. There's a lot to consider. Okay, all right. Thank you, guys. It's scary, but you gotta be brave. Just <laughs> bien, no? What are some of the things that concerned you that he said? Dying. I gotta be in Mr. Mac and reading. I'll see in science and in B and art. How do you feel about that? Good. Yeah. <laughs> that looks nice, right? It took me like um, like two weeks. I mean, maybe we are far. We can see that sky. I see the skyline. It looked beautiful. <laughs> when it was my first day here, I was scared because I heard that this school was like a bad boy school. But now this school has helped me a lot with my anger issues. Now that I know how to ignore people when they talk about me, I just let that go. This is my daughter, she's been missing for a week. If you see her, could you please call that number? Hey, have you seen her? No. No? Sorry. All my life I wanted to be a gang chief. Once I got to the top, my friends started dying around me. The same place y'all had it, 
if y'all don't take control of y'all selves, man.